So today, as you come before the Lord and you say these words to each other, I love you, it is no little thing. It is indeed a great thing. Because what you say to each other is what Jesus said to us. I give you my life. They seem like simple words, but they mean great things. Need you, baby. We'll walk in the footsteps and build our own family one day at a time. Ten little toes, a painted pink room, a beautiful baby looks just like you. Just take my hand and I'll be the man your dad hoped that I'd be and we'll be Hi Romeo Take your ring To be my wife I promise to be true to you And good times and in bad And sick as any else I will love you and honor you All the days of my life Irena, take you, Romeo, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. It can seem like what you say today, Romeo, can be a little thing. Like, how does this all fit in God's divine plan of this huge universe? It's just us. And yet, it's exactly, I think, how the Lord works most deeply in us in the world. The little things. The things that say, I love you. Praying to take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Romeo, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Then I'm very happy and proud to announce to all of you, Mr. and Mrs. Robituro. When I first heard Reyna was talking or seeing some guy from San Francisco, I already knew I wasn't going to like him. You know, there's this whole NorCal, SoCal rivalry in sports, right? So of course, LA fans, San Francisco fans don't get along. This is not going to be any different. But when I met Romeo, I couldn't help but like him. 
I mean, I tried not to, but I did. He was kind and respectful, good looking. Found out he played ball too. I mean, how could I not like him? He's just like me. Reign of Rome, there's no real advice I can give you to that you haven't heard already. You guys have been together over eight years. I'm sure you heard it all. But what I will say is this. Don't look back on those past eight years wishing things could have gone this way or say, I should have done this. No. Continue to move forward and make new memories. Make those mistakes you two were afraid to make before because that's the only way we learn. And when you learn from those mistakes together, that's when you'll know that what the two of you have is nothing short of an amazing marriage. You know, Reina, I can't even begin to tell you how it was walking you down that aisle. So many emotions. And I think, I, I think a lot of you saw my allergies acting up. And I don't know if any of you know, but I was 21 when Reina was born. And so, I guess you can say, I was a kid having a kid. And I didn't know what I was doing. But having you, Reina, made me realize that I needed to do something with my life. I needed to provide for you. So thank you for turning my life around. It wasn't just me I had to think about. It was you too. I needed to step up. And then I also remembered all your milestones, your first steps, your first day of school, graduating high school and college, becoming a nurse, becoming a mom, and now today, your big wedding day. And as I reminisce, I felt so proud. You've accomplished so much. And watching you and Romeo with Raiden, it's just so perfect. You guys are doing a phenomenal job raising me. Thank you. I'm so very proud. I love you so much. Jen, I just want you to know, bro, I love you. I love you more than you know. You're like the little brother I never had. Or you are my little brother, man. I'm happy for you, and I'm honored to be your best man. Raina, since I met you, you've always been solid. I am thankful that you are part of our family, and I'm grateful that Jun has you in his life, and I'm happy that you found your Romeo. But if Jun ever gets out of line, don't hesitate to hit me up. I got you. One piece of advice I have for y'all is be patient with each other, give each other grace, and keep communication open, because I know as Geminis, we tend to hold stuff in and keep it bottled up until it just erupts, right? So. Just keep communication open and that will definitely take y'all a long way. To Reyna and Romeo, my best friends. <laughs> May God continue to bless you two with love, happiness, and more children. I love you guys. <laughs> So beautiful on our wedding day